Hi, I'm going to show you how to insert someone into a photo like this and make them look like they belonged there in the beginning. Um, we took this group shot of all the guys here skiing and then we had this other guy show up. So my husband took his picture like this and what we did was we selected him and then um, we moved him over into the picture which you can do by doing like this if you go up to the top here. Hit V for your move tool and then drag him up to the layer where the other picture is like that. Alright, I'm going to undo that though because we don't need him there twice. Alright, so there he is. Um, and then we took him over here. Uh, we did, let's see, Apple T which is free transform. Bring him down a little bit more to size right about like that and hit enter. Um, but now he's got his arm out as if he was going to have it around my husband Ed, but in, at this point he, we need to get rid of his arm. So you have two options. You can just kind of erase his arm off really sh with a sharp edge like that. But what I showed my husband that I would do is I activated the background and I'm going to shut off the view of the second guy here. And then I'm going to do L for um, lasso and do a quick... Uh, lasso around these guys here. Um, this is not going to be perfect because I'm doing it really quick. I already did it once and it came out awesome. So just this side here to the left does not matter. We're just going to be duplicating it. The layer. Alright, so there we go. Now what we want to do is duplicate that selection. And because the background is highlighted, that's the part that is going to be duplicated. So I'm going to do Apple Command or Control J. That duplicates that layer. If you look over here in layers, you can see it's right there. So we're going to bring up this guy again, but we want him to be behind that layer. So I'm going to bring, drag that layer down, and there he is behind the layer. And I can hit the V for the Move tool and kind of just move him around to where I want him. And there you go. All right, from there you flatten your layer, and you're all set to go. All right, hope that will help you inserting someone into a picture.